What's going on YouTube? Bromance here. As you can gather, I bought the Snoop Dogg pack. I love it. I really I do love it. I've maxed it away and I think I feel I'll show you what you get of it when it's all maxed out. My only problem is that there's no animation or gesture of some kind where you smoke a blunt while killing someone or something like that. You know, like the old pack on Modern Warfare where you smoke a cigar. It would have been too good. I would have loved that. But, you know, it is what it is, so I'm happy with pack anyway, so it's really good. Obviously, I've maxed all these out. Well, I've maxed the character out, like all the operators. You know what I need to do now is that one. I ain't gonna bother these ones. I just need to do these challenges for these, these three people. That's it. But it's back to Snoop Dogg. Right. That's one you start with. That's one you get when you've obviously. It's how you a challenge anyway. Max level operator, at least three operators, units. That's what you unlock at level 20. Level 17. And level 10. I must have prefer it on, but I just have this one to show it off, like, it looks good. And these are the stuff you get. Yes, yeah, me. The one and only you did. Guns are fun, but I'm proficient with blunt objects. I'm a lot of things, but loser ain't none of them. I guarantee Snoop Dogg made them millions a day he came out in this game. And I bet he made a lot of money himself for doing that. All the stuff he has to do, like the voices and the, the look. Execution. I love this execution. Would have been cool again if after the execution he smoked a blunt like the Captain Price cigar thing. That would have been too good. That's definitely sort of what I would do. How can you smoke a blunt when you've got a bandana one though? I love it, I do. I love this pack. I won't buy any more packs now. I mean, I've only bought the one pack before this, and which one was that again? I bought, there was some, some um, uh, what do you call it? I'll find it soon. What's that one? Oh, yes, that. The only pack I did buy was this one, because it had the Volk variant I really liked. I had the attachments all way. I needed to try to max it out. Uh, what else did you get? Oh yeah, but it was... Uh, no, wrong one. Customization. So you get a calling card and the emblem. Was there another calling card? I don't think there was. A quick look anyway. I don't think there was another call, uh, calling card, but... Some of I didn't even know I had. Nah, I don't think it was. I know there was a, uh, it wasn't a frame, but it was some emblems. And you get that emblem. And you get that one to start with. And you get these sprays. I'll show you that was for a battle pass, but you get that one. I can't remember I got that one. And you get that one. And that one. And you also get this pretty cool uh, weed farm kill cam thing. That's the one I got in the last pack. I had a ball. What was that one there? One of these ones. I think it might have been... That's a Christmas tree thing, isn't it? So yeah, I think it might have been that one I actually got. That's done. Put that preview. When it loads up. Yeah. Pretty cool when you know when you in a cool campaign when you're killing someone. Pretty cool. But that's pretty much what you get on the pack. Oh yeah, I've got to show the guns as well, and I. Uh, if I got the armory, did 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 get a salt rifle which is a Cooper carbine. The Cooper carbine variant you get in the pack doesn't look the best, but you know it's. It has a green tracer pack as well, so it's pretty good. Obviously, I would, it's not exactly the attachments I would use, because it's really rapid. It's more like a summoning gun than it is a rifle. 
It's not something I would use myself. What is that? Oh, it's the old man. That's nice. What bundle's that? Actually, it's not, again, it's not a gun I use much. I mean, I've got it gold recently, but it's, again, it's not a gun I use. Two of these, to be honest, they're gonna probably end up nerfing at some point. Where are you? Oh, here, West Coast Bling. That's pretty much what it looks like. It's not the best, but look. Again, it's not the best class either, it's not some I would use. I changed it up straight straight away and done my own little class with it. I never used compressed rounds. I tried this class setup and it was really rapid. If you're going to use this class setup and you want the look of it, I would probably change your recoil booster to the Fate Stabilizer. Just to balance it out a little bit. I mean, the remove stock would be okay if you want your, like, you know, like your moving speed and sprint to fire and stuff like that, but... The optic I definitely would use. Uh, 60 round mag is good if in the right class setup. Vital, yeah, real good in this class. But again, I use brace most of the time anyway. That's it, the rifle you get. Oh, you get the submachine gun, which is the MV40, which is what I do like. It looks real nice. Ah, here it is, called the shit in it. Looks real nice, I like that. Again, the MV40, it's not a gun I tend to use much. It's quite overpowered, and I, in my opinion, it's way too easy to use. But that's what you get. Obviously, I changed the mag straight away from the. Uh, I mean, it's all right. Like, I don't know. But, uh, you know, the uh, rapid fire mag that is. It's all right, but again, it's not a setup I I would technically use. And it, unmarked proficiency works well if you haven't got ninja on, but I tend to use ninja on search. Anyway, and I didn't use MP40 on search. If I use it on free for or 10 to nuke. It's a bit too easy to use in my, in my opinion, but... And I've never used incendiary shells. Never. I can't stand that thing. The amount of times I have lost a nuke after I've already killed the gun and I've died by incendiary shells, it, it's not a good feeling. I mean, I use most of those attachments. Especially the barrel. Especially the under barrel and the muzzle I do use. I do use stipple grip sometimes, and I do use the iron sights. And the folding is a good stock for MP40. Other than that, I do use a lot of that, but yeah, I did change the mag to the um, 64 or the... You know, it depends which one your preference, really. If you're going to use the 32 round Greg mag, you probably best off changing the muzzle to a uh, face stabilizer. Uh, sniper rifle, wasn't it, now? You get it. Now, here it is, straight away. I like it, but in my opinion, it's more of a war zone thing. To be honest, for multiplayer, the optic zooms in way too much. They could have put an optic on it. To be honest, this is definitely a war zone setup. I changed it straight away, especially especially with the stock and the muzzle. Nah, not my thing. Proficiency, okay, that comes in handy. The 20 round mag is actually better than it looks, even though it does. I think it takes um damage or something off it but well no it gives damage I say but it takes your ADS but I did change some of this setup but the optic it looks nice but it zooms in way too much face is definitely a warzone setup probably be perfect for warzone to be honest if you're a warzone player or rebirth but I wouldn't use this as for a multiplayer this doesn't work I tried it you know it's alright if you're going to quit scoping you're aggressive with it if you're used to it it will take a while to get used to it to be honest but I don't know, I didn't like the optic. I had to change it straight away. But again, I'm still working on living a free line rifle up. But that's pretty much what you get. There's not much else you get, really. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed today's little video. If you do, please like and subscribe. And if you want to stay up to date with all my content, please hit the notification bell. Take care, guys. Peace out.